Hey, so I am new on Robin Hood. I've been trading for about three weeks. Uh, they say Robin Hood has a free non commission, non commission broker, or whatever, but I think that's far from the truth. It's a huge lie. Uh, if you're trading, buying or selling, let's say, when you're buying, you would hit trade, you buy, and you would come here. Now, let's say the market price is $3.29. <clears throat> and you would pick the number of shares. Let's say you want one one share. It'll say three dollars and twenty nine cents. You come hit the uh, the arrow. It'll say that you'll swipe up. They will, if you're buying it, they'll charge you at least a penny to three pennies more. If you're buying like low shares, they'll charge you three pennies. If you're buying high shares. They might charge you a penny, you know. So, I doubt it's free. And like, I know the, the stock number didn't change because I'm watching on a different screen. The stock didn't change. The stock price was three dollars and twenty nine cents for a whole two minutes, but they charged me a penny, a, a penny to three pennies more. And you're like, why are you making a big dollar of a penny or two when you're buying three thousand shares? That penny is going to make a big difference. So every time you're buying and selling, you're paying $30, $30 or more. Yeah, if you had one penny to 3,000 shares, you, you, you're you talking about like $30 for every time you do that. So, And also you could lose money. If you're trying to buy the, the stock the same price you sold it for, uh, they will charge you more, at least a, a penny or more. And you would end up losing. And, and it happened to me a couple of times. This is, this is not like my first uh, time I, I sold. I, I tried to day trade. And that didn't work out well. Uh, if you try to day trade uh, with four times in one week, they would mark you as a day trader. And they would eventually uh, restrict your, uh, your, your account. So I don't recommend it. Uh, there are some nice things about it, but it also has features I don't like. Like, you can't zoom in. Uh, I don't think I found a perfect stock, but I'm going to Weeble. There are some things I don't like about Weeble. Uh, it's not really usable for a, um iPad or a phone. It, you can't scroll to see the, the times because it takes two fingers to do it. It's really annoying. But, uh, let's say here you would watch it with one screen. It'll be 329 and you will swipe up, and you, you will find out that it charges you more than the stock price. So they do charge a commission, but they lie about it, uh, which is unfortunate. Uh, it's not really a good uh, business practice. But uh, what do you guys think? You know, give me your feedback. Thanks.